Not only is LCS back in full gear, but there was also the Eastern Rift Rivals. And since League of Legends never stops, we don't either. We compiled the best plays from this weekend specially just for you. So sit tight and hold on to your gaming chair. Here are your League of Legends Plays of the Week. Surprisingly, he's really good in that position. So I'm excited to see it. Back to you guys. And they're trying to deny the blue. Oh my <laughs> god! He flashed for it! <laughs> yes! Madman! I love it! Oh, that's the best thing I've seen all week! He's right on double lift, AD carry next to him, so. Ooh. Big damage to Kumo. Okay, gets in the melee range for the one, puts him back into the turret, impact and a chase! Can't find the knockup! Kumo! One more turret shot! Oh, he's got the solo kill! Kumo! Difficult to pull off. JD thought that they can go in for a flank. In fact, they still think they can get Barrel. this ball. Yeah, might be off to the side. Scan of the week doesn't land. Is there the ultimate? Wow. The flank in the ball and pulverize from Barrel Canyon. The Requiem. And Zoom is going to survive for the moment. Flash out from him. He's going to get him to safety. But there's the zombie Zion underneath the turret. And JDG are on the wrong the side of the map. Get in there, Alistair! Yeah, Barrel looking for it one more time. Your gal's gonna die. There's the knockup special delivery! Oh, Looks potentially for a dive here. I think they are. Yeah. Gonna find damage into Apollo. There's the flash Q lands on a Gragas action. Enough damage is in for first blood already. Now into the turret for Hakuho. He's got 200 HP left. The turret doing a lot of damage to contracts. Who he pulls Aggro as well. Do they complete the dive? Waiting for the Ren cooldown to come back up. Another Vine's gonna land. A oh. single auto. And oh. the man, who he grabs it. The Golden Guardians duo is 2-0 already. He secures that. We're into a 1v1. Oh, uh, meanwhile, that 1v1 is gonna turn into a solo kill for Wiggly. He tries to get away from Acadian, turning it right back around, able to find some vamp. The King Slayer! It's Jamie Lannister, baby! Wiggly's going right back in after Acadian. Power of Evil shows up for the kill, and there you go! CLG 2 for all! There on the rookie, he's by himself, separated, can't get the slow. Level 16 Camille ready oh. to go in. Jackie Love goes in with the killer instinct himself, finds it, and that's a one for one trade. Now for ID, the flank from Faker is insane! The Azir gets the free hit, and IG are separated, torn. Faker can't get through, but live through this. Jackie Love over the wall, it's Jackie 2! Korea fills it, and Faker fills the whole damn play. He's back. CLG are sticking around to get these inhibitors. Smoothie goes in! Smoothie tries to make it happen, but he's not gonna do it. Wiggly tries to go in now, pop of the ulti defensively. It's two slicing maelstroms. It's Sven cut down and broken blade on the run. TSM can't get anything from this one. They're gonna lose two. They might lose three. They do get the kill back onto 6A. Bjergsen in retreat is cut down by POE. And CLG are on to the Nexus turrets. TSM are stuck in the fountain, and for the first time in 1,176 days, TSM's Nexus will fall to CLG. Now, there are currently three teams that are tied for first place, C9, CLG, and TL. We know for sure that the upcoming weeks will be a roller coaster. So if you want to keep up to date, make sure to tune in to Esports in 30 every weekday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time. And if you like the video, don't be scared to hit that like button and check us out on all our socials at Squad State. Till then, we'll see you all next time.